Hi guys, this is George Robinson here with GFP Business. In this short video what we want to do is show you how to create a separate lists or groups within your Facebook account. Now personally I've not done a lot with Facebook in the past because of the fact that anything that I post or share was going out to my entire following, all my friends, family, business associates, etc. Now to me that's not terribly useful, some it may be, but what I would like to do is send out certain information to a particular business, different information to a different business, to different information to my friends and then my family again separate. So like quite often you don't want to be promoting your business to a list of your friends and family, because that can be a good way of losing friends and family at times. So it's nice to be able to keep all the separate identities uh, separate and you can post whatever information and share whatever information with each individually. So we're going to create some groups. So if you log in here, now this Facebook account I just set up for this particular video. So um, I think we've got a whole two friends in there. Now like most things there's a hundred different ways of doing the same thing but what we found pretty simple is if you go to friends you can see this more link comes up, click on that and that takes you to, now these are the uh, lists so called that the company sets up for you by default when you create an account. What we're going to do is push the plus create list and now type in here a name, something descriptive to you so you know exactly what it is that um, this list is going to be for whatever you call it, whatever name, the people within the list or any other list will not be able to see this name, so it's only for your own reference. So we're going to call it Go Fun Places Business. Um, now you can add members to this group here or you can do it shortly, I think it's easier to do it shortly, so we'll go create. Alright, so now you can see we have this new um, list in here. Now we just need to add some friends. So if you just create a new list then you've already got no doubt a list of we already got a whole lot of friends so to put them into it if you click on your timeline come to your friends as I said before I'm not very popular I've only got two but um, we're working on it so we've got hover over the name and then come down to friends hover over that now you can see it's come up with the default um, list that the company set up but we want to show all lists now you can see the GFP business that we just created is there. So click on that, um, which ticked it. And we'll do the same for this fella. Um, hover over there, hover over friends, show all lists, and click on GFP business. Once again, ticks it. That's about it. Now if we go back to so our home page, this is our whole feed. So whatever we type in here, info is going to go out to all of your friends, family, business associates, prospects, etc. Which is not really what I want to do. But So if you come down to your list, so we've got GFP Business, click on that. And now we've got these two people that we just put in there. Um, so it shows all the information that they are posting and sharing. It's a reciprocal, so it goes both ways. And now we want to promote our business to these people. So whatever we type in there is just going to go to these people only, not to the rest of our friends and family etc. Now as you are building your following, you're going to have new friend requests coming in each day. Well, that's the aim anyway. So if you come up here we've got one you can see waiting. You can click on that. Um, Marion Robinson, so we want to confirm. Suggest friends, not at this stage. Now once again hover over her name once we've friended her. Uh, hover over friends, sorry, come down here to show all lists just as we did before and we can put it directly into that list. And that's it, so now we've got our free people in here. Now if you want to edit this list you can, you can add it to favourites or delete it and of course you can come up here and create as many lists as you want. Very simple stuff but it makes Facebook a lot more useful and particularly for business side of things promoting it. So good luck with that. Any problems, let us know. Otherwise, we will see you in the next video. Cheers.